In this video, we are going to find out what are the changes for PTCB exam in 2020. If you like this video, please like and subscribe for more educational videos. The previous nine knowledge domains, 2019, pharmacology for technicians, pharmacy law and regulations, sterile and non-sterile compounding, medication safety, pharmacy quality assurance, medication order entry and fill process, pharmacy inventory management, pharmacy billing and reimbursement, pharmacy information systems usage and application. Now, the new contents for the PTCE will be reduced to four in 2020. One, medications, 40% of exam. Two, federal requirements, 12.5%. Three, patient safety and quality assurance, 26.25%. Four, order entry and processing, 21.25%. The PTCB exam is the PTCE, Pharmacy Technician Certification Exam. Beginning in January 2020, candidates must complete a PTCB recognized education, training program, or equivalent work experience in order to be eligible. To be eligible for the PTCE, a candidate must complete one of the following two steps. Step one, a PTCB recognized education training program or completion within 60 days. Candidates choose from more than 1,400 recognized programs. Step two, equivalent work experience as a pharmacy technician, minimum 500 hours. This alternative secondary path serves experienced technicians who are not in a position to attend a PTCB recognized program. PTCB accepts work experience across pharmacy practice settings that pertains to certain knowledge requirements. How to apply and schedule. One, create a PTCB account. I will leave a link in the description below. Two, apply for certification by logging into your PTCB account. Three, once your application is approved, you will receive an email with your authorization to schedule your exam. Four, you may schedule your appointment online. The PTCE is administered year-round at more than 1,400 Pearson Professional Centers nationwide, including more than 100 military on-base sites. About the exam, the PTCE is a computer-based exam with 90 multiple-choice questions, 80 scored questions, and 10 unscored questions. Unscored questions are randomly placed throughout the exam and are not identified. Be prepared to commit two hours for the exam, five-minute tutorial, one hour and a 50-minute exam, and five-minute post-exam survey. Your unofficial exam result will be presented on the screen immediately following the post-exam survey. You may also receive a printed copy of the unofficial exam result at the test site. Official exam results will be posted to your PTCB account within two to three weeks. The cost to apply for certification and take the Pharmacy Technician Certification Exam, PTCE, is $129. Exam Day Requirements Arrive at the designated Pearson VUE Test Center 30 minutes prior to your appointment. Bring an approved form of identification that matches your name as it appears on your PTCB account. You will not be allowed to take the exam without proper identification. While the preliminary score reports presented on screen following your exam are typically an indication of your performance, they are not official or final. Official score reports are typically available in your PTCB account within two to three weeks from your exam date. PTCB cannot expedite the processing of exam results or certification information. If you pass the exam, your certificate will be available to download through the PTCB account. Within your PTCB account, you may also choose to order a fine paper certificate with a wallet size card for a small fee. Salary. Pharmacy technicians in hospital environments usually earn between $16 and $21 per hour. The average pharmacy technician salary is $37,623 as of February 26, 2020. But the range typically falls between $33,931 and $41,971. If you like this video and find it useful, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.